This group of Singaporean pilots is preparing to step for one of the early missions in this green flag exercise. While they're a long way from Singapore, they're used to being far from home. Their home unit is the 425th Fighter Squadron, based at Luke Air Force Base, Arizona. The 425th is a composite unit made up mostly of pilots and aircrew from the Republic of Singapore. Another unit like them, at least in this size and scope, does not exist in the U.S. Air Force. The 425th has been a squadron at Luke Air Force Base since 1992, and the unit that comes in from Singapore, it's a detachment of Singaporean pilots as well as uh, other assorted personnel, including maintenance. They came in 1992 as well, and that detachment, as well as the augmentation by the U.S. Air Force, make up the 425th Fire Squadron. Green Flag hosts units from all over the world, so for the 548th Combat Training Squadron, which hosts the exercise, this is nothing new. Uh, and this is an example of a coalition partner. So in the past year at Barksdale, within the past year and a half, we've hosted uh, F-16s from the Netherlands, uh, Tornados from Germany, and Mirage 2000s uh, from France. So, Singaporean or American, the goal here at Green Flag is to put their combat air support, or CAS skills, to the test under unfamiliar conditions. Here, a lot more humid, which is different for our targeting pods. Uh, these are some older pods. That's been one of the, the differences with just the, the trees, really, more than anything. Like I told the guys this morning when we briefed, we've been doing this you know, at home for weeks. It's no different. It's just a, a different departure and a different recovery, but we're still working with the same kind of guys, and we're still doing the same thing. And, and it turns out it worked about that way. Green flag generally lasts anywhere from two to three weeks during which time they'll be exercising in conjunction with Army ground forces at nearby Fort Polk, providing simulated close air support for their training needs as well. Staff Sergeant Larry Moore, Barksdale Air Force Base, Louisiana.